Okay, so I got a request. Someone needed a little help with Windows Movie Maker. Um, you may or may not know, I have both versions for XP and Vista. Today I'm going to be using Vista because I really dislike the XP version. Um, so, your first question, I believe, was, um, how do you apply certain effects to certain parts of a clip, but not all of it? And... I'm not sure if you've heard of this, um, but it's something that you, you'll really find handy in video editing, and it's called the split effect. Um, it'll really help you, and that's how you can apply effects to certain aspects, or not aspects, time frames. So let's say you want it to start slowing down at 20 seconds into the video. Um, you drag your timeline cursor to 20 seconds or wherever you want the effect to start and over here on the preview there's a little button that says split click that and as you see it splits the clips into two and let's say you want that effect to last uh, 20 seconds so 20 plus 20 is 40 so you go to 40 seconds or wherever you want stop the cursor there and hit split one more time so now you're left with three subclips. Or no, these are main clips. Um, select the one in the middle. You don't really have to select if you don't want to. But um, Then you just apply your slow down or speed up. I'm going to make it slow down. I can't remember what you asked for. So slow it down to that one. And so there you go. It will be normal speed at the beginning. And then right here, it slows down. And then at the end of that split clip, um, you hit normal speed again. And you can use this, um, you can use split for anything you want. If you, um, for any effect, you can even add transitions, but it might throw your timing off a little, but you can second part of your request was um, okay I don't really understand your second part of the question some then your third um, request the longer my video my movies get the more they seem to drag that drag is called lagging actually digital lag and take ages to do pretty much anything any advice on this um that would be you've got to compress the video it's too big or it's the wrong file type I'm pretty sure it's the file size you might want to try an online compressor since I have Sony Vegas it compresses files to whatever I want so I wouldn't know any so uh, I hope this helped if it didn't no I'll be willing to help you out some more so just send me a message